Yo YouTube, you know who this is, your boy DJ Cool Thing from Cool Thing Entertainment. Welcome back to another video on my channel and welcome to the first look at the brand new Serato DJ Pro version 2.5. So let's go ahead and show you guys everything. First, let's go to Safari. We are going to uh, go to Serato.com and we're going to take a look at some of the brand new features, some of the key features of Serato DJ Pro version 2.5 and one of them is Mac OS Big Sur compatibility so let's go ahead into Serato because I can't remember all of the key features so let's go ahead and go to the Serato website wait for it to load there we go Serato Pro Take a look at Serato Pro version 2.5, and of course we downloaded on my practice laptop for my cousin, uh, Serato Lite version 1.5. And here we are, we're going to go down to uh, Downloads, take a look at some of the brand new key features of Serato version 2.5. As you can see here, the first one is the uh, macOS Big Sur and the M1 chip support and it has the it's the official support for mac os 11 big sur and the apple m1 chip in some of the newer macbooks and like the macbook pro macbook air any computer with an m1 chip it has compatible it's compatible with it now which is pretty good uh phase support if you have phase now an official serato accessory get improved accuracy reduce latency and new features when correcting or connecting phase through USB. There's now no needed for RCA cables. That's pretty good. Just like you're connecting a DJ controller through USB. Uh, Reloop ready support, a two chum controller that combines portability and performance equipped with touch sensitive jog wheels and 16 RGB performance pads to use, to use with the Serato DJ Pro uh, pad modes including scratch bank uh sitting flush on a 13 inch laptop so you can prepare or practice your sets anywhere and for streaming the offline locker for uh beat source link and b port link St store up to 100 tracks on your device to access and play without an internet connection uh, note, uh, Link Pro and Link Pro Plus are required. So if you just have the Plano subscription, it'll be just like playing music off of Tidal or SoundCloud, you know, with just an internet connection. Uh, new expansion windows, uh, an improved workflow for exploring and managing your Serato Pro and expansion packs, licenses, and subscriptions. That's pretty good. You know, it's a pretty good piece of software. And we're going to the software, and here we are. As you can see here, my uh, SR2 works perfectly with it now. The performance pads work. I'm going to go to a song. I'm not going to play it, but to show you, it does work. Here's one of the cue pads. Go over here. Right over here. And as you can see, they, they all work. Shift and then of course get rid of the uh, the loops here as you can probably see it's very responsive, you know, it's always been responsive And uh, It's now working with uh, Mac OS Big Sur. That's the biggest for me is the Mac OS Big Sur compatibility Where it'll work 100% which is good because I have a wedding to do on May 23rd and of course May 29th so I got two weddings in the month of May and I definitely need Serato Pro or else you know just be inconvenient for me and the pad won't work nothing will work but now that we updated Serato DJ Pro version 2.5 it now works as you can see here it works um, it still looks exactly alike as you probably see here with the uh, the layout of Serato Pro but some things have you know been updated but some haven't but you know Serato is definitely one of the best uh, piece of software for me 
alongside record box and then of course you can go to my products and our license code log out uh, manage profiles settings different settings same uh, expansion packs you know different expansion packs the help expansions as you probably see here that's a new is a, a brand new layout for managing stuff and that is pretty cool so it shows you my current license which is serato pro uh full license for serato pitch in time serato play which was free for you know during the during the pandemic the wolf pack which i don't know what that is but you know i guess it's different effects I don't have to say. Say so it shows you everything. So the check means those are the ones that you're currently using. As you can see, I'm using Serato Play, which is you know just DJing with just my laptop, uh, Pigeon Time, and Serato DJ Pro, which is the full license. So I do have a DDJ SR2 from Pioneer DJ. And you can go to your expansions here. It says manage set um, manage settings for your expansions in the setup screen. You can tap on this where you can manage your profile by going to the website. So it takes you to the website for managing your profile. Uh, my products, it takes you to the website to show you guys um, the Serato products. You just enter a you can enter a license code because you know if you get a license code or a product license for Serato uh, Pro. What else is on here? Uh, enter license code, and of course you can log out, which I'm not going to log out. I'll spend some time to setting up the day, but yeah, yesterday. And as you can see here, it's so easy to use my DJ SR2 with Serato DJ Pro. And what I can do is I can go to a song. I think tonight's stream is going to be used the you know using the Serato version 2.5. That'd be kind of cool. So we're gonna have my DJ SR2 with my laptop, my streaming laptop, with the um, with the Tiani 4 and OBS, and so that tonight's stream on Twitch is definitely gonna be using the new Serato 2.5. I just want to test it out on how it is on a live stream compared to using Recordbox. So we're just going to take a break from Rekordbox and see what we got. So this is an awesome piece of software. As you can see, nothing much has changed except for a few features here and there with streaming, with Beatport Link and BeatSource Link with the offline locker and the M1 support for the Apple M1 chip, as well as uh, Big Sur support, which I do have. I've had Big Sur for a while. And now I finally now have the new Serato DJ Pro version 2.5 that is 100% compatible with Mac OS Big Sur. As you can see here, it works flawlessly and the pads work, the samplers work, and a lot of stuff actually works and it's not grayed out anymore because it's a software thing. And it all works flawlessly with the tempos and the effects and using the browse knob and man I am super blown away with how awesome this you know software works with the DDJ SR2 from Pioneer DJ so now Serato DJ Pro is 100% fixed and ready to go for my next wedding which is May 23rd and I'm excited for that because I will be using the DJ SR2 for reception, for cocktail hour, for dinner, because everything is in one spot. And of course, we use the DJ 400 for ceremony, and we'll pack it up right after ceremony. So yeah, that's just uh, something I wanted to discuss with you. That it's now 100% compatible. As you can see, the performance pads work, the rolls work, slicer works, sampler works, everything works. I mean, it's always worked, but only the basic stuff worked. But now everything works 1% on the DJ SR2 with Serato DJ Pro version 2.5.
And of course, we can go to the tram, um, high, mids, and lows, low and high pass filter. I mean, it's all, it's all there. And the loops work. Oh, uh, okay, so yeah, the loops work. So yeah, the loops do work, which is pretty good. Uh, key shift works. And the uh, reset button works. Um, the slicer works, the roll works. See, it works, really, really works. And the hot cues work, as you probably see here. The uh, hot cues work and cue loops work just fine. So yeah, it actually works this time. That's the cue loops, um, save loop, slicer loop, pitch play, and it all works as intended. We're gonna press shift, and of course we're gonna get rid of those. I mean, that's pretty neat. Sampler volume uh, works, the headphone volume works. Yeah, the headphone mixing works, the volume works on the front. Everything now works 100%. So now I can go back and use the DDJ SR2 as intended. See, I don't have to worry about things not working or anything because that's a software thing. Now, Serato DJ Pro version 2.5 came out. This thing now works 100 plus percent. And as you can see here, um, the uh, so yeah, my sampler still work. The effects still work. The record button still works. Everything still works. You know, vertical, horizontal, extended. And it's the same layout, four deck mode, which is pretty good for switching through different uh, decks. You can probably see here, which I don't really do four deck mixing. I do two deck mixing since I do weddings and I do parties. I do school events. I'm a I'm basically a mobile DJ, going from gig to you know from venue to venue, and I do two deck mixing one song to play now and the other song to queue up later so it's kind of smooth but I hope you guys uh, enjoy that nothing much has changed with Serato 2.5 as you can see here the uh, controller works 1% so let's try a subfolder and see how easy it is to get to a subfolder Decades, there you go, and it works. Uh, hits by genre, if I want to go to hits by genre, it's so easy to get to. Using the uh, SR2 from Pioneer DJ. And yeah, that's basically my first look at Serato's brand new Serato DJ Pro version 2.5. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and the notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a brand new new video. Till next time, your boy DJ Cool Thing from Cool Thing Entertainment, out. Peace.